I'm special, especially honored to be here at Morgantown High on a day where we remember those who have paid the ultimate sacrifice so that we may gather like this today on a special day to honor them. I've ran by this school numerous times and I love coming by here, especially running down this street as I'm able to stop and salute the flag and look at the pictures and the names of those that have served this country so honorably from right here in our own community. A memorial that pays tribute to those that have paid the ultimate sacrifice. In 2003, there were, oh, probably five or six of us that were officers, and we were trying to figure out a way that we could get the community involved and do some things to recognize members of our community. And we got to talking, and we started talking about how there were a lot of member, former members of the Key Club who had served in Vietnam and several that had been killed in Vietnam. Um, Tommy Bennett had been an officer when he was in Key Club, and we wanted to kind of recognize their service. We, got, we started researching, um, and there were just several that had been killed in Vietnam and a couple in other places. Um, my, I remember my dad, he was, when we first started talking about it, he, he could remember all of the people he had graduated with and exactly where he was when, they had, when he had found out that they had been killed in Vietnam. So it was, it started out as a very small project. We thought we could sell some lollipops and maybe raise enough money to make a plaque. And we sold lollipops for two months and we were, only had $50 and we were like, this is not enough. So someone suggested, let's ask the veterans if this is something they'd be interested in being involved with. And lo and behold, within three months we had enough money and within six months we were ready to have the stone in, out in front of the school, which it started out over there. And then when they added on to the building, we had to move it over here, which was kind of traumatic at first because that was... It, it's, it's almost sacred, um, the place that we put it, but the stone is still intact and that was what was important. And so they moved the stone over here. And the first year there was only a handful of people. And each year it's just grown and grown and grown. And it, it's, it's magical because you can see where people are getting more involved and recognizing the importance of Memorial Day and the importance of the sacrifice that those men gave because they gave the ultimate sacrifice and my my dad remembers playing basketball with the guys on there and then they went away and they never came back and because of that I have the opportunity to be here today so it's just awesome. wonderful. For the grandpas we watched were so gallant.